Once upon a time, there was a boy named John, a girl named Darlene, and a radio station named KWPC. John and Darlene met each other for the first time on February 15, 1992. It was a blind date. Well, one month later, they got engaged. Two months after that, they were married. And three months after that, they purchased radio station KWPC in Muscatine, Iowa. This was John's hometown and the place where his career in radio began. Over the years, John had moved on. He was managing a radio station in Washington, Iowa, when he received a phone call saying that his hometown radio station was for sale. It had fallen on troubled times, was in disarray. All the ingredients needed for a good fairy tale oh, were in place. Yeah, so be grabbing me. <laughs> oh, we're on. Are we on? The Mama? microphone too, Did that huh? pick me up? <laughs> <laughs> Way to go, Dar. All right, that's enough of me. The building that housed KWPC was one time a farmhouse. So it's two floors and on the second floor was the sales and administration. This is John's office, or soon to be, and all the staff members from the sales department, five of them worked on getting the upstairs in shape the way we wanted it, and the downstairs staff, air staff, news staff, office staff, they worked on the downstairs. Family and friends, retailers, even local industry got involved with helping revitalize the radio station. Son Warren joined the team immediately and soon became our leading salesperson. Daughter Carla learned how to paint. Darlene's sister and husband, Ed and Sandy Lamp, were very helpful. And contractors and retailers also held big time with discounted pricing. It seems everybody wanted to help. We had to make major changes to the entryway had to knock down a wall, widen the front door, add a window to let more light in. Check out the windows. I think every window in the place had a big window air conditioner in there. The place was so noisy you could hardly hear yourself think, let alone run a radio station. There's Tim and Darlene. Off to run errands. And here comes daughter-in-law Kathy with baby Sierra. That's Warren's wife at the time. A real family gathering.
Note, no window air conditioning. New paint. In many cases, new windows. New widened doorway. Doesn't the staircase look better? New welcoming front office. In here, we're going to do PJ's Quality Guns for Sally. Colorado Springs, this is Ron from the mountaintop. Oh, we're in Denver. It's a mile high up there. PJ's Quality Guns, the Muscatine commercial, coming to you live from KWPC in Muscatine, Iowa, home of Muscatine Communications, owned by John and Darlene Schwanke. Here you go, folks. PJ's Quality Guns Hotline, your name is? Daryl. And Daryl, you're a... A black guy. Daryl, what seems to be your problem? Duck season's almost here, and I just found out that PJ's Quality Guns has all kinds of supplies to make my life more miserable, like federal duck loads, Gary Light duck decoys, and sure shot duck calls to fool even the smartest ducks like myself. I need help. Sorry, Daryl, you're on your own because PJ's Quality Guns is the sportsman's friend with all kinds of accessories for the duck season. They accept major credit cards. Where is PJ's Quality Guns? 1019 Hershey Avenue. Why? As a duck, I'm going to need some kind of advantage. Well, sorry, Daryl. Well, again, the advantage is always on the side of the hunter that goes to PJ's quality guns. Well, you see, folks, uh, <clears throat> hunting is not always what it's quacked up to be. Now back to music on KWPC AM Stereo. <laughs> From Kenny Loggins to Madonna, we're the radio station playing you just the right mix of all your favorites in AM stereo all day and all night and keeping you informed too with everything you need to know, information, 
weather, news, sports, and so much more. Keep in mind, it's all right here on your stereo mix, KWPC. NFM N what? N uh, N is in November. Why am I supposed to smile? Can you back that up? I don't want everybody to know that I sit here and look so serious all the time because it's really not a serious job. <laughs> Who's NFM? This is our oh, morning announcer. Right here, please. Have a piece of candy. Yeah, oh, thank you. That's all right. Bye, golly. Oh, you do a good job. job. Yeah, yeah. One for Gary. Yeah, okay, you're oh. working on Saturday for that one. Yes, I'm on the oh, okay. thank you for that. Thank you, old master. You go back thank downstairs you. now. Yes, <laughs> our vicious guard dog. Not very many people can hold this vicious animal. Get him, Lagrish, you vicious guard dog, you. No, no bite. No, no. Master's wife, may I have some? May I have some labels, please? Labels. <laughs> we never get labels here. We beg for them. Tim has a whole box. He hides them. He doesn't distribute them evenly. So unfair. Unfair I'm, labor practices I'm going, going on here. I'm going to be kind oh. to you. Oh, thank I'm you. Going to give you two oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, hi. I do without her. Good afternoon, KWPC. May I help you? <laughs> oh, I love it. Let's get a little closer and see what a mess she has over here on her desk. <laughs> Ooh, I just felt everything. <laughs> My sister did a video of me one time. I was laughing so hard. I came in the room and I felt this is stop stop. <laughs> it's still recording. <laughs> Well, hi, welcome to KWPC. How you doing? I'm doing fine. It's great. Can I get a quick interview with you upstairs real quick? Yeah, we got all kinds of people coming out here all at right. the radio station. What up?
as you come up the stairs here, what you see, in addition to my bald spot, if you're above us looking down, are the administration and sales offices of the radio station. The radio stations were using both levels uh, independent uh, as far as all of sales and administration is on the second level and all of studio and production is on the first level. So as you come in here, my office is in here. Now, <clears throat> my wife Darlene and I are equal partners uh, in the business. We bought KWPC in January of this year and we flipped a coin to see whether I got this office or the next office. Mm -hmm. And uh, actually she won the flip. Okay. <laughs> so she said, please take this ugly big office so that I can have this nice compact small office. If you come around the corner, you'll, you'll see Darlene's office. She's right in there. <laughs> Hi, Darlene. Hi, guys. <laughs> and then as you turn around and you come down here, we're going to pause the story there for now. It continues on for another seven years, during which time the business grows to include two radio stations, a sign company, and a website called The Voice of Muscatine. The business was sold in year 2000. For those who are curious, there's another YouTube video entitled KWPC KWCC 1998 Station Tour. It shows what the operation looked like after the full build-out was complete. There are many who contributed to the success of these radio stations, and I hope some of you are able to see this video. May God bless you.